How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we got a story time of a very strange uh, furry kid in class who tries to fight the subscriber because he disrespects his uh, wolf heritage or something. I don't even know. <laughs> I honestly don't even know. Uh, this is a pretty crazy story. So sit back, relax, subscribe if you're new, leave a like on the video right now to claim your free nothing, and let's jump into it. So we're going to call the subscriber who submitted the story Aiden. And this was a very tough start for Aiden because this all happened on the very first day of school. And so first day of sixth grade, Aiden gets there and he just moved to this new uh, location with his like with his parents. So this was like first day of school type vibes. And, uh, yeah, it was pretty, pretty, I don't know, pretty scary. I mean, a lot of the other kids had, while this was like the start of sixth grade for them too, they kind of already knew each other. So Aiden was kind of on his best behavior, definitely looking to make the best first impression. And, uh, yeah, it's always difficult in situations like this because like you don't know anyone, you're going in fresh, you have no idea what's going on, right? So anyways, Aiden makes his way in, and let's just say that Aiden is about to have a very interesting, interesting with massive light like, quotations, a very interesting first semester, to, or very first day to say the least. So anyways, uh, they all get in, they all sit down, and there's like a little bit of buzz of talking, probably mostly from the kids who knew each other, being like, oh, talking about what they were doing over the summer, whatever, right? Eventually the teacher gets in and tells them to quiet down a bit and says, hey class, like welcome, this is your first class and first day of sixth grade uh you know we have a lot of new students here i know a lot of you kids already know each other but let's do some introductions for the new kids sake yeah so anyways right they go around or they're told to kind of like go around the room and like say their name and a fun fact i always kind of dislike this i know this might be a hot take but i always dislike the whole fun fact type thing because I don't know if it's like actually like a fun fact sometimes like i don't even like i don't want people to know <laughs> like for example i would never ever in a million years be like yeah i run like a youtube channel i co-run a YouTube, another youtube channel i post stuff on spot i would never say that's my fun honestly that is my fun fact but i would never say that because then people be like eh, you know that kind of stuff right so what ends up happening is i just say oh i have a dog like, it's so boring and so lame, but I guess maybe that's like, I don't know, that might be a specific thing for me and not for normal people, but, uh, nor oh my god, I, <laughs> I just said normal people, bro. I mean, by that, I mean I'm freaking weird. Anyways, um, yeah, so sure enough, the subscriber's thinking, okay, like, uh, let me think of a fun fact. And he's like, all right, I'm actually pretty good at baseball. That'll be my fun fact. So it goes around to Aiden, and he's like, hey, my name's Aiden. Like, I play baseball. If you guys play baseball, like, let me know. Love to talk to you about that, whatever, right? And, uh, yeah, so eventually kind of just keeps going around the room, and then it goes around to the the uh, the furry kid, right? And I just want to say right off the bat, I kind of I do not care what you like to do in your free time. So while I don't necessarily understand, like, dressing up like animals, also, like, I, I post YouTube videos in my free time. I don't really have a lot of room to speak. So as long as you don't act like this kid in the video, I genuinely don't care. Anyways, right, so uh, we're going to call him Wolf Kid um, because you'll see in one second. Anyways, the kid stands up, which, first of all, no one else stood up. Like, everyone just took it sitting down. Bro's taking it super serious. So anyways, yeah, he's like, uh, like, uh, like, hello, my name is, uh, I'll say Ben. I'm just gonna call him Wolf Kid from this point on out. I want to let you guys know that I'm, my fun fact is I am a descendant from the wolf gods. And, uh, you know, as he's standing up, everyone notices he has this big, like, gray furry tail attached to his pants. And, uh, yeah, so I don't know about you, but I don't totally know how I'd react if someone says... I'm a descendant from the wolf gods. Like, I don't I don't know about you, but I just, I mean, I'm not going to, like, say anything. I'm not going to go up to them and be like, oh, what you're doing is stupid. Like, obviously, like, I, I have a life. I don't need to do that, right? Uh, however, I don't know, man. Like, what do you even mean I'm the descendant for? Like, out of all the fun facts, remember, people were saying, I have a dog. I play baseball. I go to the same school as you. Like, really mundane fun facts. And then this kid comes out and says, I'm a descendant from the wolf gods? Like, what? What? Huh? Yeah, it's kind of a little strange. And, like, I think this kid... I mean, the thing is, like, uh, the subscriber Aiden says or told me that, like, no one else was really, like, seemed that shocked or confused. 
So probably this kid had been like, you know, had been in the neighborhood for a while. Most of these kids had gone to school with them before. Kind of stuff like that. So I bet all the people were like, oh, yep, it's a wolf god wolf kid again. Like, whatever, I guess. And <laughs> but like, yeah, it was just like, dude, what? What kind of school am I going to, man? Like, he was just genuinely so confused. Like, dang, bro. Where am I even going? Like, is well, what kind of Harry Potter ass like place am I going to right now? Anyways, though, yeah. So sure enough, um, you know the subscriber is kind of confused. Uh, he's kind of like weirded out or whatever. But who cares, right? He's kind of like, well, I might not like relate to this kid on his wolf descendancy or whatever, right? But you know what? Fine, that's fine. We don't. I don't have to be friends with literally everyone. So, uh, yeah, the next thing was after people went around and said everything about themselves, they were put into small groups. So, yeah, the teacher basically said, all right, and today, like, a first, the first day of class, we're not going to do anything too difficult. It's more about just for you guys to understand the class and for you guys to under get to know each other better and for the kids who already know each other to, like, get to know the new kids. So he said, all right, well, we're going to be put, we're going to put each other into random groups. Give me a second. So the computer, like, hat or the computer, the teacher has the list of students in the class listed on his computer. So basically what he does is he just, like, uh, puts all those, like, he puts, like, a random number generator, and he says, all right, well, divide, like, we, like, take 20 integers and randomly divide them up into five groups or ten groups or whatever. I don't know. Uh, you just divide them up into groups. So, yeah, sure enough, each number was, like, associated to one of the kids on the roll call attendance, and from there he put them into random groups. It was just so the subscriber's luck that he was put into a group with the wolf kid, right? And the subscriber wasn't, like, upset about this or what. He doesn't really care. He was like, he really just does not care. He might not, like, I don't know, relate to the wolf kid about a lot of stuff because, uh, uh, well, I mean, might be a little hard. But anyways, right, he didn't think much of it. So yeah, sure enough, the uh, the wolf kid and the subscriber, they were all sitting in a group together with another kid. We're, we're not going to give him a name. Sorry, other kid. You're just not consequential enough to the story to get a name. You're just going to be other kid for now. So they're all kind of like sitting there and they were, uh, you know, instructed to... Uh, I don't even know what they're instructed to do. Well, probably just some, like, type of mini project. Something super inconsequential, wasn't for a grade, and was really probably just, like, a one of those, like, team bonding activities or just to get to know each other type activities where it's, like, you need to do something, but no one really cares. Like, it doesn't really matter how well you do it. It's just to get to know other people. Somehow, though, right, some, I think one of the questions, for some reason, must have been, like, favorite animal, and so the subscriber doesn't even think anything of the fact that this kid is, like, f uh, wolf god heritage, right? He doesn't think anything of this, right? So the subscriber is just like, uh, I don't know, I think my favorite animal is, uh, I think he says, like, yeah, he says something like, I don't know, like, the capybara things. I have, like, literally my entire Instagram explore page is just... Uh, silly monkeys and capybara videos. I'm not gonna lie, I've spent more time on Instagram because of that. <laughs> My feed is great, guys. But yeah, the for some reason, so the subscriber looks up and sees the wolf kid, and the wolf kid has this, like, shocked and appalled look on his face, right? And the subscriber is, like, looks at him, and they're kind of just staring at each other for a second, and the subscriber's like, yo, dude, you good? And the kid's like, oh, uh, oh did I hear you correct? Did I hear you correct? And the subscriber's like, um, um, uh, yeah, I think the, the capybara videos are kind of funny. Like, I think they're cute. And the wolf kid's like, whoa, 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 dude, 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 dude. I'm going to give you a second to, uh, we consider what you just said. And the subscriber's like, what? Uh, okay. Um, I reconsidered and I'm still going with the capybaras. They're pretty cute. Uh, yeah, that's my favorite animal. What's your, and the wolf kid's like, Oh, <laughs> the subscriber's like, dude, are you good? Are, are you dying? Do you need medical assistance? Like, bro, what? Uh, and yeah, so the subscriber's kind of looking at the wolf kid like, bro, I really don't need you to blow a gasket right now. That would not be super epic. Um, and kind of just is like, what? And the wolf kid's like, oh. <sighs> You do not understand how disrespectful you're being. And the you know, the subscriber's like, uh... Because, like, remember, dude? Like, remember, the subscriber's new. He's new to the neighborhood, new to the sixth grade class. He's not trying to cause any drama. He's not, gonna tr he's not trying to cause any issues, right? He's really just... 
I don't know, just he's just trying to make it by, right? He's trying to find some people to be friends with. School is hard. And the wolf kid's like, dude, you do not think wolves are the best animal? And, you know, the subscriber's like, oh, I mean, it's not that deep. They're pretty cool. And the wolf kid's like, no, no, no. I know you are very scared right now because you know how disrespectful you are being, but you can't, no, no take backsies, bro. And the subscriber's like, okay, cool. <laughs> just like, <laughs> dude, <laughs> it's not that deep. And the wolf kid's like, <laughs> mm, I feel, I feel the blood and the anger of my wolf ancestors flowing through me right now. And the subscriber's like, no, dude, no, he's being weird again. Oh, God. Because the subscriber was like, all right, I know this kid has a tendency to be kind of strange. I really hope he just isn't strange with me. And yeah, he got his wish inverse granted. It was like anti-granted, bro. He got the basically the complete opposite of his wish. This kid not only was not just like kind of weird to him, he was the most mega weird as possible. Like, I don't think this could be, I don't think this kid could be more weird to him at this point. Yeah, so the subscriber is kind of just looking at the kid like, oh, God. And the wolf kid is like, <clears throat> you have <sighs> angered <sighs> my ancestors. <sighs> I feel it. They're, they're coming through my blood. Their spirits are angry. And the subscriber is like, dude, it's not that deep. Like, I, I think wolves are cool too, bro. Like, I, we in second grade, man, like, we were supposed to pick, like, our favorite animal. And I picked the wolf. So, like, I do like wolves. He's like, dude, why did you say the freaking capybaras when I asked you what your favorite animal was? And the subscriber is like, dude, I don't know. Like, I guess wolves are the greatest. He's like, no. You are just scared of the wolf power going through my blood. Oh, and like the subscriber's like, no, no, no. This is the worst way my first day of school could go. Like, please. And then so the, the wolf kid raises his hand and the subscriber's like, okay, what is he going to do now, bro? And the teacher's like, yes. Kind of like comes over. He's like, yes, Ben. And the wolf kid, Ben, is like, oh, teacher. Uh, Aiden over here is being disrespectful to my heritage. And the teacher's like, oh, uh, uh, because the teacher's in this really awkward position where she does kind of is assuming that something weird's gonna come out of what this kid's gonna say. But at the same time, like, this kid's actually being disrespectful to his heritage. Like, that's, that's messed up, right? Uh, and then, so she's like, oh, what do you mean, Ben? And she's like, uh, Ben's like, uh, well, Aiden was like, I was like, what's your favorite animal? And he was like, can't be bears. Like, what the freak? He knows that I'm descendant of wolf god, so what, what's going on? <laughs> and the teacher's like, okay, Ben, how about we calm down? You know what? You know what? Aiden's new here. He, you know, he's trying to make friends. Let's not, let's not, let, let's be normal, okay? <laughs> the teacher's even like, bro, relax. So Aiden and the wolf kid and the third kid, right? Remember, the whole time there's been this third kid who's just been sitting there so uncomfortable, right? After the teacher leaves, they all just sit there in dead silence for like a good minute, maybe even two minutes, bro. Like it's really uncomfortable, real tough. And after two minutes of silence, right? The, the wolf kid, Ben, looks over at Aiden, the subscriber, is like, dude, you know a wolf could like eat a capybara in one munch. <laughs> What? I'm just sorry. I, I try and I try and hold character during during these story readings, but it's just like imagine a kid comes up to you and says, "Dude, my wolf ancestors could eat a capybara in one bunch." Like what? What are you saying? Um, and Aiden's like, "Okay, I mean, genuinely, how else are you supposed to react to that besides?" Okay. Um, cool. That's not. That's nice, man. Woo! <laughs> Go you! <laughs> like, dude, what? Yeah, so sure enough, the wolf kid's like, I just wanted to let you know that your stupid capybaras would be eaten up so quick by the wolves. <laughs> and, uh, you know, Aiden's like, okay, man. Uh, okay. <laughs> o okay, man. Yeah, so the, uh, the, the wolf kid is about to do something pretty crazy, which just really just solidifies this as probably the worst first day of class anyone has ever had. Oh, real quick, though, if you made it as far into the video, comment wolf in the comment section down below. And if you're listening on Spotify, I think there's a comment section. I don't know what it's called, but go comment there depending on where you're listening. And also, if you're on YouTube, make sure to check the pinned comment as there's a link to the Spotify. I'm posting there a lot. I would really appreciate it if you guys are Spotify users to follow me on there um, and then listen on there if you'd like to. Uh, also, if you're a YouTube listener right now, uh, if you want to help me out, 
Uh, add this video to watch later. Uh, I'm just a little theory I'm trying to test out. So if everyone adds this to your watch later, I think it might boost a little bit. We'll see. Anyways, let's get right back to the story. So, uh, yeah, sure enough, uh, the wolf kid's about to do something crazy. Because they're all sitting there, and they're all kind of, like, huddled around the table. They're all just, like, around the table, right? They're all just, like, I don't know. They're just all, like, sitting there awkwardly. And, the, and remember, this is after the wolf kid's like, bro, the wolves would, like, eat a capybara so fast, bro. <laughs> it's like, dude, okay, good for you, I guess. And so then, after, like, another five minutes of silence, the wolf kid's like, dude... I freaking hate Campy Bear so much! And, like, the subscriber's like, bro, okay, I'm sorry. Like, I guess wolves are my favorite. He's like, no, you're lying! <laughs> He's like, okay. And so the wolf kid's like, oh, oh, oh. He's like, bro, bro's actually freaking out. He's like, duh. The wolf ancestors are speaking to me. I must consume. Dude, if some, like, weird kid was sitting next to me who is angry at me and then screams that his wolf ancestors are telling him that he must, quote-unquote, consume. Consume? Consume who? What, me? Yeah, actually, he was saying that. So, uh, he looks over at the subscriber. He's like, you, you're looking tasty today. No, no, wolf ancestors, don't make me eat them. Ooh, you're looking so good. And the subscriber's like, ah, oh, hell no, nah, bro. So the subscriber is really uncomfortable because this kid is literally having a conversation with himself, like fighting off the wolf spirits, being like, uh, I'll eat him. No, wolf ancestors, don't make me eat him. <laughs> like, bro, okay. So the subscriber is super awkwardly just like, oh my God. And he looks at the other kid who's sitting with him. The other kid's like giving him a look of like, I'd hate to be you right now, bro. I'd hate to be you. With a burning passion, I'd hate to be you right now. So yeah, sure enough, the subscribers is very awkwardly sitting there. The wolf kid's like, I must consume. I must avenge my ancestors. And uh, the subscriber's like, dude, are you okay? And the kid looks at him and he's like, don't look at me. I'm fighting off the demons. <laughs> the subscriber's like, okay, okay. And he's just, he just hears the wolf kid sitting there like, I hate crappy bears. I hate crappy bears. <laughs> um, yeah, so this is like, Imagine, bro, just imagine for a second. This is your first day of school. Like, this is your first day of school. This is it. This is like, welcome to the new neighborhood. These are the kids you're going to be friends with. <laughs> or maybe not all of them. <laughs> um, but yeah, these, these are your guys. This is your life now. This is your life. And this is, this is your introduction. I'd be a little sad, too. Uh, yeah, but anyways, right, so sure enough, the, the subscriber's kind of looking at the wolf kid, and that's when the wolf kid's like, oh, 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 I cannot, like, the wolves have taken over me, and he looks at the subscriber, and the subscriber and the wolf kid just, like, kind of, they just make, like, eye contact for, like, a minute, and the subscriber's just like, oh, no, 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 and the wolf kid's like, too, too powerful, and then the wolf kid, like, jumps out of his chair, goes onto the ground and is like squatting on all fours and the subscriber's like oh god no 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 and that's when the wolf kid's like wolf attack and he like opens up his mouth like unhinges his freaking jaw and bites into the subscriber's leg the subscriber kind of like gets a lets out a yelp because it like kind of hurts and he also didn't see it coming and the teacher turns around to see the wolf kid on all fours biting and gnawing and chewing on the subscriber's leg yeah, I bet when this teacher went to teaching school, he was not informed that he would have to worry about, uh, yeah, like, welcome to day six of, uh, teaching school. Uh, today's class is how to deal with a wolf kid who's been possessed by his ancestors because a fellow classmate told him that his favorite animal was in fact not a wolf but a capybara, so he decides to try and consume his classmate by eating him from the leg up. That's normally not a class, at least an introductory teaching, maybe an advanced teaching. You might get a class on that. But uh, what I'm trying to say is the teacher rushes over, is like, like, what are you doing? And the wolf kid's like, the wolf ancestors are controlling me right now. It's not my fault. And <laughs> the teacher's like, get up, get out of here. Sends the kid off to the principal's office. I mean, like, I mean, kid's going to get in trouble, bro. So gets him up. And the subscriber is just sitting there. And the teacher goes over to him and is like, are you okay? And the subscriber's like, yeah. Uh, like, it kind of hurt a little bit, but it didn't, didn't break skin. And he was also wearing long pants, so, like, you could see the teeth marks on the pants, but they didn't go through to the leg, which was pretty good. However, the wolf kid had a ridiculous amount of slobber and drool, so his pants were, like, covered in drool and slobber. It was really disgusting. 
And the teacher's like, I, look, I'm so sorry. Like, you're new here. Like, I didn't know this kid was going to do that. Like, this isn't a great introduction. How about I put you in this group? So he takes the subscriber and the other guy who was just standing there the whole time awkwardly and put them in a new group of guys. So the subscriber goes over, sits down with the group of guys, and the group of guys are like, bro, like, we should have, like, you know, you're the new kid here. We should have come up to you and warned you about the wolf kid. Like, that's a, not the first time he's pulled that off. They're like, we're so sorry about that. And, like, the subscriber and these kids, it's like they start having a conversation about, like, the wolf kid. And, the, and, the, and they, they're telling him about, like, oh, yeah, he's done this for ages, whatever. And the conversation kind of evolves from there. And it kind of turns into, like, what, okay, what do they do around here? What are kind of, like, other things he should know? Because, obviously, the wolf kid is, like, one important thing to know about. Tells him, basically, the rules of the road around here. And what ends up happening is the subscriber, Aiden, starts hanging out with these kids outside of class. Because, at first, they're, like, guiding him to make sure he doesn't have any more wolf kid incidents. But then they find out that they have a ton in common. And uh, so, that weekend, Aiden goes to try out for the, the local um, baseball team. And they're all on the baseball team. And so immediately they start seeing each other, and they this happened about a year ago, and now they're super close. So yeah, Wolf Kid might have uh, been a little weird, but at the end of the day, he set up Aiden with his best friends. So at least the story isn't all bad. If you want to support the channel, click on one of the videos on screen right now. It helps me out, and uh, peace.